It's him, or are you just that self-conscious? I'm not that- Is there something you want? <laughs> That's my line! You are the one stalking me! Stalking you? That's outrageous. I know you've been following me, ever since the train! That's because... <gasps> my goodness! I had wondered why you left the car, so this is where your passion led. All is well that ends well. <laughs> I saw you from the car, and I couldn't help myself from chasing after you. I didn't even notice the calls from Sensei, but thank goodness I caught up to you. Okay... What? You're the woman I've been searching for all this time. Please, won't you? W wait a minute, I... Be the model for my next art piece. M model? All that I've drawn till now has been lacking, but I feel a passion from you unlike anyone else. This man's highly suspicious! Ain't this a recruit for some shady business? Will you cooperate with me? What do you say? <laughs> Hold your horses! Who are you anyways? Oh, where are my manners? I'm a second year at Kosei High's Fine Arts Division. My name is Yusuke Kitagawa. I'm Motorame sensei's pupil, and I am being allowed residence at his place. I'm striving to become an artist. Huh? Do you mean that, Motorame? The one who was on Good Morning Japan the other day? The very same. You know who that is? He was introduced as a super famous Japanese-style artist who's been recognized all over the world. Uh, but we heard that name the other day in Mementos. Yusuke! I'm sorry, Sensei. I'll be right there. That old guy's Matarame? Matarame Sensei's exhibition will begin at the department store near the station tomorrow. I'll be there to help out on opening day. Please come by. It'd be great if you could give me your answer in regard to being a model then. I bet you have no interest in the fine arts, but I'll give you tickets too. Well then, I hope to see you there tomorrow. <laughs> that guy's as easy to read as a book. You're not planning on going, are ya? I think I will. Crap, look at the time! I'll see you later! How dare he go after Lady On! I've memorized that face of yours, Yusuke. You became acquainted with Matarame's pupil by chance? 
That's a little too convenient. It makes me wonder if you're even telling the truth. So be it. What I want to know most is your method. It's true that Madarame was an unforgivable criminal worthy of the scorn thrown at him. He was an adult who cultivated his own fame and fortune by sacrificing the livelihood of children. But how did you discover such horrible deeds that were hidden all these years in such a short time? This metaverse business again? <sighs> Fine. Let's suppose that people's hearts can be changed by stealing their treasure, like you've said. If so, a different suspicion arises. People have gone mad or lost consciousness never to recover, like the subway accident in April. Depending on how you look at it, that could be taken as a phenomenon for a sudden change of heart too. Were you related to those as well? Hmm. I see. <clears throat> Fine. Continue telling me about Madarame's case. Keep it concise and only of the truth. Hoje é o último dia de provas, hã? Huh? Qual o problema? Você está demorando demais para passar por essa questão? Hum, isso não tá indo muito bem. Eu não esperaria uma boa nota. It's over. It's over. How about you? You two need to get your act together. Anyways, can we stop talking about the exams? Like it or not, they're gonna come back graded next week. Rather than focus on stuff that's over with. What are you looking at? The usual site. It's no use. There ain't any useful info. The number of posts are getting less and less too. I am not letting this end as a one-hit wonder, okay? There's no point in getting antsy, though. I know! Why don't we go eat lunch somewhere? We still have some money left over from the other day. I want sushi, then! Or domestic-raised eel. We don't have that much left. Oh, right! There are those tickets to Madarame's exhibit. Wait, that's tomorrow. Don't tell me. Was it love at first sight with that Yusuke guy? It's not like that. Oh, of course not. When I was watching that special on TV, his artwork was pretty nice. Plus, we've got free tickets. Besides, this could also be related to what we heard in Mementos. Matarame, was it? Hmm. That aside, what should I do about the other two tickets? Wanna go appreciate some fine arts for once? <laughs> fine arts, huh? I suggest we should all go together. Appreciating the fine arts builds character. A phantom thief who can't identify an original is lame. Well, if everyone's going... It's settled then. Just the phrase, going to an art exhibit, sounds kind of mature. Let's meet at the exhibit entrance tomorrow. Okay. Amanhã nós iremos na exibição com a Lerie. Estou curioso para saber se o Madarum tem alguma coisa a ver com o nome que nós ouvimos em Mementos. Independente do que for, não podemos nos atrasar. É melhor irmos para a cama cedo. Então, eu continuo pensando no que o Nakanohara disse. 
será que ele estava falando mesmo do famoso artista Madarame? É, eu acho que sim, não temos muitas opções. Eu concordo. Ótimo, o nome realmente se destacou pra mim. É, quer dizer, quem mais você conhece que se chama Madarame? Não é um nome comum de fato. Se o que ouvimos é verdade, então o Kitagawa está estudando com um professor muito corrupto. Você quer dizer, um professor que trata as pessoas como ferramentas? O Kitagawa deve levar uma vida horrível. Nós temos que dar uma olhada nisso. É, pode apostar que temos. E... É, eu acho que eu confundi dizendo que o Madaram é um artista das artes... É um, é um cara das artes marciais. Eu acho que na verdade ele é um artista. <risos> Ops, me desculpe pelo corte. Eu tive que fazer isso por um momento. Enfim. Amanhã nós temos a exibição para ir. Estamos indo para a exibição amanhã, certo? E te recebe Madaram. Uma infinita fonte de ideias, hã? Eu li as propagandas do seu ingresso, mas parece que Madaram é realmente um artista incrível. Daí valer a pena darmos uma olhada em algumas das suas obras. É, provavelmente. Nossa, essa foi rápido, tive que. Uou. Enfim. Boa noite, gente. So crowded. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, all right? You came. Um, yeah. You really came. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. Come now, I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture I'd like to draw, too. Well, see you guys later. Will Lady Han be all right? What if he drags her behind some painting and tries something funny? I told you not to come out! Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? I guess we should do a quick pass through at once. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? Hmm? It's that old man from the other day. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? Well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart, like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. Naturally, you say? What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. A shack? I see. So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> Wasn't the word shack something? Madarame-san is actually here? Over there! I'm so glad I came on opening day. Stop pushing! There's way too many people! I'm getting crushed! Anyways, we gotta head for the exit. Don't die on us, alright? I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. 
Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, Sensei creates all this by himself. He's special. There you are, Yusuke. Sensei! Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to put it into words, but it's really amazing. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artists satisfaction. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me... You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. But he seems really friendly. Indeed. Oh, this is it! The painting I wanted to see in person! This one? I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this... strong frustration from it. To think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. <laughs> Something wrong? Don't mind me. There are better pieces than this one. Come now, this way. Hey! Ah, that old lady totally elbowed me. But thanks to that, I remember now. Well, let me get to it. It's about a post online. Here, look at this. Why'd you leave without me? You got it all wrong. We got dragged into this huge crowd and... Anyways, you gotta look at this too. This post might be about Madarame. What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Plagiarizing? I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Matarame triggered it. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Abuse on top of plagiarism, hmm? If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. I wonder if Kitagawa-kun posted this. I mean, he is a pupil of his. Who knows? It's anonymous and all. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. A man like that doing such a thing? I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. Oh, actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with mementos? Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Oh, yeah, right. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? No, right? This all fits way too well to just be a coincidence. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Well, yeah, but... Is it really true? By the way, what did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitagawa-kun gave me his contact info. And the address to his sensei's atelier. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Matarame's house right after school. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? This is too sudden. What? We're just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Oh, that's what you meant.
Nós precisamos descobrir se esse rumor sobre o Madrano é verdade. Se for, deve ser exatamente o que estávamos atrás. Sim, exatamente, Morgana. Ele pode ser o alvo famoso que nós estávamos procurando e... Tudo bem. Tudo bem. Eu vou só aumentar minha proficiência, então, pra não dizer que eu não fiz... Claro, 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 Morgana. Eu não vou mais discutir com você, só vamos dormir. Eu não posso fazer nada nesse maldito jogo. Ah, é mesmo. O grande artista Madarama está fazendo uma exibição em Shibuya agora mesmo, não está? Eu vi várias vezes seus trabalhos. Céus, aqueles trabalhos magníficos. No momento que eu os vi, eu sabia que tinha alguma coisa a mais. Falando nisso, você parece não estar muito ligado em arte, Turner. Ah, please. Come on. Você sabe que criou a obra que foi vendida pelo preço mais alto no século XX? Oh, shit. <risos> ok, um, Eu não gosto desse tipo de arte. Um, eu odeio estudar a história dos... <risos> Madarame, claro. Eu, eu odeio estudar a história dos artistas, mas eu sei a época deles. Se eu não me engano, Picasso é do século XX? Nas... Um, e o Van Gogh... Eu acho que ele não nasceu no século XX, o Picasso, mas enfim. Van Gogh é do século XIX, eu tenho certeza. Por essa linha de raciocínio, Van Gogh deve ser certa, porque ele já tá morto. Então as coisas valem mais. Acertei. <risos> Ótimo. Parece que você sabe uma coisa ou outra, afinal de contas. Aquela obra foi vendida pelo equivalente a 18 bilhões de iens. E foi vendida por ainda mais caro mais tarde. Entretanto, com a virada do século XXI, um novo recorde de preço parece que é feito todo ano. Hey, você sabia dessa? Eu não tinha ideia. Talvez ele seja mais inteligente do que pensávamos. Oh, droga, o professor está nos olhando. Oh, você deve ser muito... Ah, é, eu sei, eu sou muito inteligente. <risos> Na verdade, continuamos com o recorde de acertar as questões sem saber de fato. As pessoas dão muita paixão e dinheiro para a arte. Se eu tivesse toda essa grana, eu não me importaria em gastar com uma pintura ou outra. <risos> Parece que a arte pode te dar mesmo uma grana. Vamos ver com nossos próprios olhos se as acusações sobre ele roubar são verdadeiras ou não. Você vai se encontrar com a Leiriane e os outros na estação, certo? Vamos logo então, logo depois da aula. Come on. Vento antes indo de trem. Isso não é diferente de como eu vou pra casa da escola, sabia? O trem é o jeito mais rápido de irmos. Além do mais, podemos trazer animais de estimação pra cá. Não! Hey, quem você tá chamando de animal de estimação? Cara, fica quieto. Nós não pagamos pela taxa de animais. Eu sou o que está guiando vocês. Eu deveria ser chamado de mestre. Hey. Um gatinho! Ah, droga. Esse é o seu gatinho, senhor. Eu ouvi miando. Um, <risos> droga. Eu vou dizer que é um animal de estimação. É um bicho de pelúcia, quer dizer. É, é assim com um brinquedo. Ele mia sempre que você aperta a cabeça dele. Hey. Você ouviu ele, Jack. Aperta a cabeça. Isso é ridículo. Hum. Ah, miau. Uh, de novo, de novo. <risos> ok, Morgana, você vai me odiar por isso, mas é hora de apertar com toda a força. Yeah! <risos> isso é tão engraçado, eu quero ver de novo. Eu acabei de vomitar na minha boca. Sério? É a nossa parada. Bem, até mais. Tchau, tchau. <risos> hum, tchau, tchau. Yeah. 
E aí, então, pra onde vamos agora? Não parece que tem nenhuma estação perto desse endereço. Se tiver, essa aqui é a mais próxima. O quê? Nós vamos ter que andar o resto do caminho? Que tipo de feito eu tive? Pega o trem, então anda até o seu destino. Para de reclamar. É, supostamente uma cabana, mas essa daqui deve ser a vizinhança. Como esperaram de um artista famoso. Parece que o jeito mais rápido é irmos para a praça da estação e então passarmos pela rua central. Vamos indo. Ok. Nosso novo objetivo. Irmos para a casa do Madarame. Temos bastante objetivos aqui, então eu acho que esse de provar a nossa existência para a sociedade é o principal e o que vai ficar por mais tempo. Enfim, eu sempre me perco aqui. Será que... É, não podemos ir pra cá. Eu já devia imaginar isso. Eu não sei se em algum momento do jogo vamos ser liberados para ir para aquele caminho, mas enfim, esse daqui é o caminho certo. Muito bem, já tem pessoas aqui conversando e... Uh! Tem um cara dando uma entrevista aqui. Igual daquela vez, vamos ouvir. Eu ou soube que você foi a exibição do Madarame. Posso perguntar o que você achou dela? Ah, é incrível. Todas as obras e seus quadros foram incrivelmente magníficas. Madarame é de fato o orgulho da arte japonesa no mundo. Ele é tão talentoso e ainda assim tão humilde. A exibição do Madarame foi aberta ontem, mas já é um grande sucesso. Os ingressos já não eram de se esperar que seriam extremamente difíceis de serem conseguidos. De volta a você, Ken. <risos> ok. Esse cara vai aparecer muito aqui em Shibuya. Eu sinto isso. Vamos indo então agora pra casa do Madarame. Espera. Esse é o caminho? Eu não me lembro de ter visto uma casa. Uh, supostamente é uma área residencial depois da rua central. Parece que vamos ter que andar até chegar lá. Vamos indo. Seguro Kamashita. Former Olympian. Teacher at Shujin Academy. Reason for turning himself in is uh, a heavy conscience, huh? The human mind doesn't change that easily, let alone their natural temperament. <sighs> Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it, just in case. Is that it? We're at the right address. The door plate does say Matarame. Uh, you ring the bell. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? No one sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? Who is it? Sensei is currently... Um, it's Takamaki. I'll be right out. People really do live here. takamaki sir. You two are here as well? Hey. Sorry, but uh we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Are you serious? We read about it online. This? <laughs> Preposterous! Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse? If he hated children so much to harm them, he would never allow pupils into his home. And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. You might be lying about it. That... That is utter rubbish. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day! You really think that? Yusuke, what's the matter? I heard you yelling. These people are slandering you with baseless rumors. 
Forgive them, Yusuke. They must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety. <sighs> Understood, Sensei. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. That's not what we meant. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Now, if you'll excuse me. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his maiden work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. It's so beautiful. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Me? I wish to pursue beauty like this. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Maybe the Matarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. Man, right when we thought we found a new target, too. How's the MetaNav? Oh. Hey, the app! Was it picking up our conversation? This display... It means that Matarame has a palace, too, right? But why? Matarame, plagiarism, and then Shaq, huh? These seem to be the keywords. For real, though, what the hell's going on? Does an old man like him really have a palace? We have the person's name and the location. All that's left is the what that Matarame mistakes the Shaq for to enter his palace. You mean, like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? That's right. Let's try saying some things. They can be random guesses. It's a bit sudden, though. Why don't we start with castle? No candidates found. Then, what about prison? No candidates found. Ah, what a pain! Jail, a warehouse, and guidance counseling office! Might as well add farm. No candidates found. Not a single hit. Should we come back another time? A building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would it be? Beginning navigation. Beginning navigation? Whoa, really?